Okay, all right, all right, come on everybody. Let's take our seats and get started. Hand out of the guacamole, do me a favor. <laughs> come on, baby, okay. I'm so glad to see everyone here this week. So good to see you. Yeah, you say that every week. <laughs> it's eight o'clock, all right. <laughs> well, hello, welcome back. Come on and join us. Not sure if you remember from our last meeting, but my name's Mrs. Reed. And yours? I'm Madison. I'm Madison. Glad you made it. So, people, last week we discussed the what happens next phase. So I thought it would be good if we had some information uh, regarding possible... Um, my God, it's so cold this morning, I can't believe Um, but, uh, I'm glad you could come in early because, uh, I'm afraid of some very bad news, Madison. And I'm very glad to see everybody was taking advantage of the healthy table today. Um, but let's thank Ruby and Charlie for hosting the first of many Get Fit, Get Healthy workout sessions in their home. That's great. Every three months, Charlie has a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I printed out some uh, stats for you all to review. And uh, quite frankly, you can never be armed with too much information when the conversation comes up with loved ones or even just getting the conversation started. And speaking of getting the conversation started, so tell me, how'd it go? Like, are you serious? I said I'll fucking call you back. No, babe, not right now. I need five minutes. Why not? I need five minutes. I'm tired. You slept six hours. So what? Besides, you know, come on, mom is in the next room. Stop. And I checked on your mom and she's like, go. <laughs> she's. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm mm -hmm. sleepy. Don't make you Yeah? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Mm. Yes. Yes. Mm. <laughs> oh my yes. God. Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Steph? Steph, can you come please get this food for mom? I gotta go. Oh wait, babe, can you just remind Steph for me that the food is in the oven for mom? And I'm serious, don't forget. You always forget. Okay. Hello, Madison speaking. Hey, Mom. No, I can't. I'm about to run to the Mom, I just need... Okay, go ahead. I'm listening. <laughs> he did what? <laughs> I swear that kid is something else. <laughs> I love him. 
He is a hot mess. No, mom, no, just tell me when I see you later, okay? I really have to go. I have a meeting I have to get to. Yes, I know. I will call you when I'm heading home, okay? I love you. All right, bye-bye. not having a breath land on my neck throughout the night or even having her cold feet on me to warm them up you know <laughs> thought about lying to the girls about why she doesn't come home anymore I didn't know how to explain death to them but I don't want to be guarded either I want them to know about their warrior mom. How hard she fought. I just want to protect them. Trust me, Sam, we all get it. It's tough enough losing a partner, but then having to explain it to someone else, especially young girls you have to raise. I mean, when do you find time to grieve yourself? You know, when do you get what you need? So you plan to just sit there all day? You're not gonna help at all? Actually, I did plan on sitting here all day if that's all right with you. Lexi, you've been sitting there on your phone the whole time. Oh, God, forget it. Fine. I'll help. I don't understand why we gotta do this anyway. Mommy asked us to help, so just help us, okay? Okay, fine. Helping. I'm helping, helping. I'm talking to you. Thank you, baby. You're welcome. So I was thinking that maybe you and I go out to dinner, movie, come back home, have some more fun. No, I think I'm gonna. <clears throat> I just want to chill tonight. Okay. Just gonna stay home by myself. I mean, the first time, you know, the friends, the boyfriend, you know, everybody was super supportive, first week or two. Then, you know, I stopped getting the phone calls, the visits, the support team to my treatments. And every time I called, it was just an excuse, so I just stopped. They made me feel like, like I was diseased, like I would contaminate them if they came around me. I'll never forget this one day. I was actually feeling pretty okay for a change. And I'm walking down a block with my sister. Seeing him, Knowing that he saw me, 
he just ignored me. <laughs> then I was scared that the new friends that I got, they were going to desert me too. And I was even scared to tell my family. I mean, expecting them to deal with the, the stress and the expenses all over again. But you know what, Mrs. Reed? I realized that my family, they got me. Hi, Mom. You okay? Mm -hmm. Are you okay, Maddie? Oh yes, it's amazing the fear this can strike in others, isn't it? And as we're the ones suffering, it's hard sometimes to understand how other people may be feeling. It's almost a how dare they kind of feeling, isn't it? But it's okay to let those people go because this is a tough journey. And you need those around you who are going to be supportive, especially when you're at your weakest. I'm happy for you, Michelle. Your family, they sound like good people. You're right. They got you. Well, the kids came home this weekend. We didn't want to tell them before because of school, and we didn't want them to worry. Yeah, we just uh, weren't sure how it was going to go this time. And if she did beat it, like before, um, didn't want them to worry, you know. But it's not like last time. No. Definitely not like last time. I guess we got caught up with everything and time slipped away and... Last thing I wanted was for them to come home to Mom's lovely new quaff. <laughs> <laughs> I love your quaff. <laughs> Come on. I'm proud of you, Ruby. I really need this. We both need this. You know, it takes a lot to get your truth out. I'm so glad the girls are supporting you along with Charlie. You know, support is essential for all of us going through this journey. <laughs> so, this is it? This is what you all do, right? Just sit around and talk about, oh, woe is me and how brave I am, right? I don't know how to tell my kids. And everybody deserted me. I don't think you quite understand exactly what There is nothing means. to understand, except that, you know what? My time is precious and y'all just wasted it. Thank you. Why the hell did you come here for if you just gonna be a bitch? Who are you calling a bitch? I'm calling you a bitch. No, you can you possibly coming up be into calling my place a bitch. Hill with your wait, 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 wait a minute, I don't care. We are all fighting for something. We don't bring this energy up in here. Not here. Fuck this meeting. Yeah, get the fuck out. Shut I'm sorry. This is me. It's okay. I get what you're feeling. We all do. You tend to feel a lot.
rant, cry, scream, whatever you have to do. This is hard. It's your mom. And I get it if you don't want to tell her yourself or tell her by yourself, but you have to tell your sisters. You're going to need them. And they need to share in this with I love all my girls. Don't worry. I'm ready to go home. Yes. Yeah. 